Right, how are we all? Hope we're all doing well. Um, right, we're going to do something a bit different today. Um, I've got some mantis that, oh, mantids, mantis, whatever it is, that need rehousing. Um, these are the first three that I've ever kept, if I'm honest. I've kept these for like 20 odd years on and off, but I've never kept mantis before. Um, and I just fancied something different, so not long after Christmas, I think it was mid-January, I got these from the spider shop, um, and they're doing alright, so the three that I've got, you have to bear with me because I might butcher these names here, is the Thistle Mantis, which is the Bl Bletheropsis Mendica, I think, the Budwing Mantis, which is Parasvendale, Parasvendali, I don't know, Affinis, the Budwing, and Philocrania, or Philocrania Paradoxa, the Ghost Mantis. Um, so yeah, they were in, well, I'd actually kept them in one of these, each of them were in one of these from, because they were quite small, um, but obviously they've grown now, gained quite a bit of size, all except the Ghost Mantis, if I'm honest. Um, the other two have got massive in comparison to what they were when they arrived but the ghost mantis has molted a few times but just doesn't seem to have grown a lot they're going into what you basically adapted old sweet tubs I've glued some mesh down one side a um, bit of substrate at the bottom and a water bowl and I've given them a piece of cock back um, and then as you'll see I'll show you in the video the lids, I've just cut the centre out of the lids and I've just got some mesh in that will screw on and that will hold it in place and I'm hoping that these will be alright, I've put some vent holes in, in the sides but yeah, anyway, I'm going to shut up and uh, rather than keep talking I'll just show you, so I'll see you on the other side, cheers
so yeah, uh, there they are. You can see, they all, all, like I say, they're all coming on really well for something that I'd never, never grown. And like I say, it was a, they were a new thing for me. I just fancied a bit of a different challenge, I suppose. Um, but yeah, these three doing all right. Um, I haven't sexed any of them because I just haven't bothered really. Um, I suppose now might be a time now they're getting some size in them. It might be a time to have a look. I think the ghost might be a male. I'm honest because I do remember reading up something on that ages ago and something to do with the, the head um, and yeah um, from the pictures I looked at it does suggest that the, the ghost one ghost mantis might be a male but as for the other two I haven't sexed them so like I say I may do that now and then you never know we may get possible breeding in the future if that's something that I just uh, some sort of a uh, road that I want to go down um, but yeah anyway that's it for this week so thank you very much for joining me and I shall uh, I shall see you on in the next one. Cheers. Ta-da.